What it do, YouTube? I know y'all been wondering what happened to the SS man. Here she go. Finally, went and picked her up from the suspension shop. Been waiting on wheels all year long. Wheels still ain't here. So now, I've been super contemplating on what I was gonna do. And then I just said, finally, it's time for the remix. Finna revamp the car, man. See, I got a couple little flaws. My little pieces back there. And then I still got the factory steering wheel. It's just looking rough right now, the little, little stuff, man. I'm finna revamp it. Uh, Motor and Trans is sold. Uh, next thing that I might be selling out of the car is the uh, all the suspension. I got uh, a nine inch Ford. I got four, uh, 12 point nine inch wheel wood brakes. I got QA ones, uh, speed tech upper and lower control arms. Like I said, the motor and trans is sold. I got the alternator off. I had to send it off to get it uh, rebuilt, but it's a uh, turbo LS. For those people that's on the channel that hasn't seen it yet, um, it's just that, man, I had been sitting on it for so long. I just been debating on like, man, what setup did I want to go with? Cause like I said, the car makes good power, but I just wanted to get a little more power out of it. And pretty much for, to get to that level that I want to really get at, I will have to just revamp. So I'm like, you know what? I'm gonna just revamp it, bro. It's winter time. I missed the whole summer. That's the whole reason I was gonna leave this in there. But being that I missed the whole summer, uh, it's over with. New year, new setup. That's usually what I do. I ain't gonna lie to y'all. Anybody that know me, usually every year I get a new set of rims and a new setup. I do this every year. This year I didn't get a chance to do it because like I said, I was waiting on wheels. My wheels still ain't here. I ordered them back in like March or April or something like that. Still ain't here. So, remix. New motor, new trans, new wheels, new suspension. We're going to pull it off the frame. Everything. I'm going all the way. You know what I'm saying? So, all the people that be tuned in, you know what I'm saying? I might even flip the color. I ain't even going to lie. I might flip the color in the interior. I'm not 100% sure on there. But, like I said, if y'all follow me, y'all rock with the page, y'all rock with the channel. Let me know what y'all think. Should I leave it the original color scheme that it is, the silver with the black interior? Or should I remix the whole car, man? Like, I honestly want to remix the whole car. It's that I've been working on this car for a nice little minute, man. Man, I get bored. So, you know what I'm saying? I don't. But then sometimes I be doing too much. You know what I'm saying? I still got the drop. The drop is over at Bedded Up right now, getting the suspension done. And then... I still got the box Chevy uh, Cream de la Cream, and then uh, the two-door Holly Berry is still up for grabs. Make sure y'all get y'all tickets. It's only 15 days left in the Holly Berry giveaway. So if y'all interested in winning that car, man, make sure y'all uh, get y'all tickets, man. The link will be on my bio, on my Instagram, at Gucci Get It Gone, or at Baja Ponte on Instagram, my boy, with the... Uh, flip-flop box if y'all know him if y'all mean y'all seen the car on my channel so i know y'all know him follow him turn his page up uh next thing man we gotta we just jumped into the dog game too i'm gonna make sure i get aurora on the channel man i want to introduce y'all to the aurora i had made a video for it which i didn't get a chance to drop yet which i will be dropping um sometime during this week i just been super busy man and then the crazy thing is my phone Got so much storage and pictures and memories. I don't even got time to, uh, I can't even drop no videos really. Cause like the editing software that I use, all my videos are saved in there. I got probably five videos that I could drop for y'all, but I can't drop them because my phone don't got enough storage to save them. So I got to get an external hard drive or something so that I could be able to drop those videos for y'all. But I ain't trying to talk y'all ear off. We finna uh, get this car put on the lift. We about to yank the motor and trans set up out of here, man. And uh, go uh, figure out how, what I'm going to go with. I don't know. What y'all think? Should I go twins? Should I go supercharger? Should I go big block? Should I go 
427 on uh, motor. I'm all over the place. I don't know what I want to do, but my boy came, cashed me out. So motor, motor and trans setup is gone. So I'm about to yank this out. It's going to be a roller. And we're going to be looking to do a new setup, man. So let me know what y'all think I should do, man. I just like to get other people's ideas. Like, what do y'all think I'm going to do? Or what y'all, what ideas y'all would do? You know what I'm saying? Let me know. Drop in the comment section. I love all the feedback that people be giving me. So that would keep me motivated. Because at the same time, I really lost a lot of interest in a lot of these cars, bro. Because this builds, it costs a lot of money. But like I said, uh, y'all be the ones motivating me to get back to it, man. So it's time to go crazy, man. Let's we'll see. A lot of people ain't never seen the uh, under hood area. And it's like I said, it's... It run, it really run good. Like I said, the car ran strong. It made a lot a lot of good made good power. But like I said, I just want to reach that certain level of where I want it. You know what I'm saying? I want. I'm trying to go all the way. You know what I'm saying? And like I said, once we get that motor out, oh, got it on that young lift. Y'all see it? How high we is? Go up some more. I want to show them the underneath one time. Let them see. Ain't no game free at all. I'll be wanting to sell this car sometimes, but like I said, I haven't had this car for so long. It'd be pointless for me to get rid of it. I was just having to talk with one of my guys the other day. It's just like, man, I got so much money tied up into this car. It's crazy. Y'all see it? Got the frame brace. See, I got the little rust. It's not holes or nothing. But I'm finna take all this, all this suspension off and I'm pulling it off the frame. The car is definitely about to come off the frame. For sure. You know what I'm saying? It's just so much. I'll be just so picky with what I want. You see, I got the frame already braced and stuff like that. So now it's just time to revamp it. This is my exhaust, all the exhaust. You pretty much gonna take all the everything the whole setup up out of here you see i got the young wheel woods on there everything just dirty from over time so like i said i'm ready to just pull it off the frame and i originally wanted to pull it off the frame when i first did it bro but like i said i didn't have my phone with it now it's time to just go all the way this ain't the original rear and this is the seven and a half that i put in here meanwhile to get it around because i had my nine inch ford broken apart and 